Okay, well, of course, it's fun to entertain friends and family on this very special day. And it's nice to be able to offer some great cocktails that really taste amazing. Someone who really knows what works well together is our friend of the show, JP Delora, brand ambassador for Milagro Tequila. And I was just telling you during the break that when I was in Mexico, I actually saw Milagro everywhere. It is, it is. You know, luckily, palettes of my fellow Mexican citizens is, is a good one. So you do see it in Mexico. You see it here in the U.S. So it's always nice that you can find it anywhere you go. And I, I do like that tequila is seen more and more now in mixed drinks. It's really sort of becoming a staple in, in a lot of those drinks. Tequila is very versatile. Mm -hmm. you know, off the bat, you have an unaged tequila like Milagro Silver, then Añejo, which is at least one year in American Oak. So for scotch drinkers, you kind of go with the age expression. And this will have the color in it too as well, yes, right? Okay. natural from um, the barrel. So we're actually going to make a cocktail with both a nut and age, completely uh, agave forward tequila, uh -huh. silver, and with the añejo. You're going to help me out. Okay, I'll help you. Okay. What's, our, what's our first one? What are we doing first? First one, we're going to do a watermelon and rosemary margarita. This is another thing you do that I really like is you're always combining the fruit with the different herbs. Yes. It really gives an, an interesting flavor. Do I do ice? First, we're going to go ahead and we're going to use our lovely hands. How? How many Let's of these? Let's do five pieces. Okay. And then a few sprigs of the rosemary. Um, yeah, it's all about a balance in a cocktail, right? You now want the you, sweet, the sour, and then your tequila. Do you want me to take these out. off the... We're just going to take a few of these right here. Okay, we're, you're going to muddle that. Okay. And once you get all the juices out, then we are going to use... You'll do four of these, these are three quarter ounce, right? Okay. So we're gonna share with, with our friends in here. Okay. Then we'll do, uh, I'll walk you through it. We'll do ounce and a half, so basically two agave nectar, and then we'll squeeze two limes in there. Everybody's always happy to see you. Did you ever wonder why? <laughs> well, I think it's not precisely me. I think it's they're happy to see the tequila, so. How many of these? We're going to do four of those. Okay. And I'll start working on wow. the blackberry sage margarita while you do that. So, uh, two different style of cocktails for the okay. summer. Again, one really fresh, uh, and then another one with a, a little bit of aging. That um, rosemary smells so good. Okay, then now we're going to use agave nectar, which is going to give it nice texture and added sweetness. I'll bet that it... Um goes well with the tequila since tequila is from agave, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. And, you know, it's a natural sweetener uh, from the plant, lower on the glycemic index, so it's really, really um, good for even your food, your yogurt, different, different... A better, um, better choice than sugar. Absolutely. Absolutely. Let's see. Let's see, I'm going to use sage, a little bit earthy taste to balance out with the berries. Okay. okay now you need to squeeze the lime juice. How much lime juice? We'll do two halves, so basically okay. one. Okay, then we'll add ice and you're gonna give it a nice shake. Okay, do this, we'll add ice, I'll add ice to your shaker over here. Looks like you've done this before. <laughs> eh? But well. yeah, these are really simple, simple uh, cocktails. At the end of the day, they're, the basis is a margarita already. We're just adding ingredients that you probably already have at mm -hmm. home or you can really find anywhere. Some ice in this, yes. Okay. So ice in here. Okay. Give it a nice shake. Shake it. Okay. Yeah. Right. Like it's a celebration, right? You it can even a dance a little bit. Okay. Always a celebration with tequila. And then here, I'll open it for you. Give it a nice. Okay, there we go. All right. Now get some more ice in your glass. And I wasn't listening. You did the blackberries, and is that sage? Blackberry okay. and sage, yes. Can I taste the blackberry? They're beautiful. They're fantastic. Mm. Fantastic. So, and then we go ahead and pour. Okay. Again, these are very easy to make. Very friendly for the summer. Super fresh on the patio. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. So that was about two drinks worth that we made there? Yes. Okay. Okay. You want to go ahead and tell me what you think? Yeah. Okay, in the meantime, I'll continue with this one. Mmm. It's so good. It does, it tastes like a, like a um, watermelon margarita. Fantastic. Yeah. And the so rosemary good. balances out mm -hmm. really nice. Okay. Uh-huh. There's another one if you'd like to taste There's it. There's another, yeah. We're going to, again, finish this one. Someone, you know, who's going to like 
the more herbal, fruity, lighter aromas. Mm -hmm. You can enjoy this one. Mm. And if not, uh, this one's a little bit more earthier. Uh, lots of oak with the Milagro Añejo, so. Can you just say tequila for me? Tequila? He's tequila nice. for you. Tequila. <laughs> <laughs> tequila mm. para ti. Mm -hmm. And a little agave nectar. That's and good. Delish. Really, mm -hmm. really fresh. This is I'm like a finish good this. barbecue drink. <laughs> Well, you know, it's also a fun activity to do mm -hmm. with amongst friends. You bring all these uh -huh. ingredients together and it's just part of the, the celebration, right? So, ice and I think it's done. fun too to have sort of like a signature cocktail mm -hmm. that you do at your parties, you know, because most people reach for beer or wine and to be able to have just one mm -hmm. cocktail that you. Right. The color of that one. All right, we have to wrap it. I'm really sad because I'm going to drink that. Two, this will be nice. We, we need to see this pour first. Mm -hmm. okay. Shake it. Shake it. Voila. Okay. Um, while he's pouring these, you can find mm -hmm. the Lagra tequila at really uh, just almost everywhere that you purchase your spirits. And hopefully you got it before today because they're not open today. But for the recipes that we made here today, just visit us at thebroadcasttv.com. Click on today's links. And we are back right after this. Ooh, cheers. Salud. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.